Now, the next thing is the technique. Of course, everybody wants to have a good technique. Well, you know, having a good technique is easy. All you have to do is practice. But you have to practice a lot. I mean, uh, you know, I was very fortunate when I was a kid because we didn't have television. Can you imagine that? We didn't have a refrigerator either. So my mother bought the entire contents of the house every day for food. She went to the shop, bought the daily food, brought it back and we consumed it. The next day she would do the same. Mind you, the shop was just on the corner, it wasn't far away. Uh, but nobody had a car. So there was one guy who had a car and we called him the sheriff because he was in the police and he used to pass with all guns and stuff in the back of the car. <laughs> And the number plate was OZ9. Z is the registration of Belfast. So can you imagine he was car number 09? I mean, they probably had A9. So I don't know many. I went up there by a year, probably. Anyway, I'm getting off the track here. The first thing we should do is practice a little bit of the Tafanil things because one of the most difficult things about acquiring a good technique is to good, get a good technique in the right hand of the flu. You know, you will see in the course of the day, if you're really paying attention, right? If you're really truly paying attention to everything that happens, you will see that most of the people who go wrong play wrong in the low notes. Now, it's not because they can't get the low notes. You just heard everybody playing all these low notes real good, right? It's because in the speed or the moment, they miss it with the finger. And the position of the hands are most important on the flute. If you really, truly wish to have a super technique, and I'm talking about a technique where your legato is noticeable. You know what I mean? If you hear clarinet players play sometimes, they, they are notorious for striking the keys. You know, they hit the keys a lot. But that's clarinet players, that's what they do. You should hear me coming through the, 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 the airport control with all my flutes. Sometimes I have about five flutes in there. <laughs> and the guys say, oh, what is this? I said, well, don't call me a clarinet player. <laughs> <laughs> and the other day, the other day, I said this to a guy, he, was, he says, what are these? I said, don't call me a clarinet player. He says, oh, I'm a saxophone player. I hate clarinet players. I hate <laughs> <laughs> this is the guy on the x-ray. I said, they're my flutes. He said, oh, yeah, all right, go ahead. <laughs> but you know, they do clatter around a bit. And I don't know how anybody plays the oboe because it seems to me it has more keys than anything else and they're all awkward. You know what I mean? But somehow or other they manage. And I think we have to also manage better when we play soft and when we play quick as well. Like a good scale played with minimum finger movement. That means minimum loss of action between your finger and the key. You know? And this is something you can very easily attain, I think. Do you know by heart which one is? Ta -da. Okay. Okay. Right. Okay. Let's stand up. Let me hear. Let me. Oh, wait a minute. Before you stand up, I want to show you something about low C. We're going to play low C, right? Um. If I have to play low C in a serious thing, like for example in, in Rigoletto with my wife, uh, I have to start one passage with food like this. So I like to get a good low C, but sometimes I don't take a chance, so I breathe in the D sharp key like this. Go ahead, open the D sharp key and breathe in it. Now breathe in the, in the foot joint keys. 
the C sharp and the C. Now breathe in a G sharp key. Now breathe in a trill key. And if you have a C sharp trill, breathe in that too. Now we're going to stand up and play low C. Let me hear your low C. Here we go. Don't forget the vibrato. Don't forget the projection. Don't play too loud. No honking. We don't need any William Bennett honking around here. We need nice good playing. Let me hear your low C. Here we go. Three, four. One. 